Yesterday, Bryce said that after the LSU game, Coach Saban kind of rallied everyone together and, um, you know, kind of changed the mindset. Um, how was he able to do that and kind of get y'all to finish the season strong? Um, just making sure everybody still has uh, the same, like you said, the same mindset and finishing, season, finishing the season strong. And I feel like everybody is uh, taking accountability and to going the extra mile to – not only finish the season strong, but get the outcome that we want to get. We talked to, to Will and Bryce yesterday. They obviously talked about making a decision to play in this game. Was that something that you had to do? Was that something maybe you asked for advice from Coach Saban for? Uh, no, it's not something I asked for advice. Uh, I knew I'm, know I'm playing this game uh, no matter what. Uh, it's something I want to do. Uh, something that I want to take pride in, and uh, I just want to finish out the season strong. Uh, you're you're one of the more highly rated players in terms of draft prospects. What are your thoughts on on possibly going pro uh, when the when the season's over, past the Sugar Bowl? Uh, I haven't really even thought about that yet. Uh, my mindset is on uh, this game and this game only for right now, and as far as then fail that's going to come so i'm just really focusing on the kansas state this is a strong chance the last time you're going to share the field with will anderson just what's it been like playing with him with a teammate and as just somebody on and off the field uh will's an incredible person on and off the field uh, a great leader and a great player to play with and i uh, i just i'm i'm happy for him and i'm going i'm going to miss him playing with him so it, what do you when you look at the, the secondary, the future, you know, moving forward? It, what do you see the future of the secondary being? Um, I feel like the secondary uh, next year probably gonna be better than uh, the secondary this year. Uh, I feel like more, uh, more, more of the players, more of my teammates gonna be more comfortable, and just is I expect big things from secondary. What are some of the challenges of tackling a guy like Deuce Vaughn when he's five six and so compact? Um, he's very, like you said, he's small, but he's able to get in out of uh, holes, and he's he's he has a low center of gravity, so it's going to be uh, a little bit harder to tackle him. But we we go against good backs here all the time, so practice makes perfect.